Hey everybody, and welcome back to the banjo. <sighs> banjo, God. Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> I did it! I confused you! No, it's because of fucking Chris. <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> hurt my feelings. I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not leaving. But you did hurt my feelings. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> Hanging around with Chris too much has gave me English impediment. <laughs> hey, hanging out with Chris too much has given me the, 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 the damn it the speech impediment. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> uh. yeah. Is this another stream level? <clears throat> I think this is the last one. Get out of my way, fish. You're not welcome. Wait, that's the last mission already? No, I think last, uh, one, last of one of these levels when you're going up a stream. <clears throat> oh, no, this isn't a final. Shit, is going to be up shit Creek next? <clears throat> See, that's what I was talking about right there. He carries some momentum when he does his spin, so I f just span right into the water. <laughs> I'm glad in future Crash Bandicoot games they fix that. You mean Magic Kazooie? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Get after monkey. You're a monkey. Cool. I oh, didn't say it. You obviously didn't get the reference. You wouldn't even know what I was talking about when I referenced that anyway. <laughs> reference what? You just got told. What movie is it from? What? what? I didn't hear what you said. When I went, monkey! Oh, I don't know. Exactly. I would think Invader Zim, not a movie but a TV show. Because after all, it's Gurr. That monkey. Gurr. The scary monkey show. Hi, Floor! Make me a sandwich. Hey, Floor, make me a sandwich. <laughs> That's better. I guess. Ugh. Ah, freaking bonus rooms. Wee. Bounce, 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 bounce. That's a good thing we're not going off of, um... That's a good thing we're not going off of, um... Uh, Super Mario uh, Bros. Um, original story I, story where all the inhabitants of the 24. mushroom of all the inhabitants of the mushroom kingdom were turned into blocks and were killing them and they all and that's like I guess that's committing murder I guess. Wait wait what? <laughs> okay well apparently you have, don't know the original story concept of uh, Super Mario Bros. Uh, it still is in it it's in the game manual but nobody would ever think of it unless it's they look at the manual. So wait, you are a murderer? Well, think of the, okay. Well, the whole point of Super Mario Bros. is that Bowser, or as he was called, King Koopa back then, you know, he was a evil sorcerer and everything like that. He went he went to go kidnap um, Princess Peach and turn all the inhabitants of the Mushroom Kingdom into coin blocks and all the blocks that you destroy, which give, you know, Mario power-ups and stuff like that. So think about this. When he destroys all those blocks, do you think he's committing murder by doing that? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. And now off to our second Wait, what? ripper room. <laughs> I'm not gonna repeat myself, Chris, because I want to continue on with the game. Okay, fine. <laughs> I'm a fighting ripper room, one of the most deranged characters of the Crash Bandicoot series, and we only see him like out of the whole main platformer series. And damn it, <clears throat> out of the whole main. You'd get hurt if you fall in the water. Of course. Oh, there you go, you just fell in the water. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't swim, right? Yeah, I just, it looked like it was shallow. <clears throat> no, dude, yeah. Hell, like e hell, hell, even shallow water would kill him. Eh, Rifferu is, eh, well, as so I was- wait, is he like allergic to water or something that it instantly kills him? Every platformer character is allergic to water, apparently. Except for Mario, but that's it. And Sonic at one point, but then when he jumps to the third dimension, he ain't a fucking weak as hell. 
And yet, yeah. supposedly, he's supposed to be the most powerful being in the universe. Because he's so pure of heart. And dim of wit. <clears throat> As I was saying, though, this is like the only one of the two times in the main series that Ripper Rue actually makes an appearance. Because after Crash Bandicoot 2, he's never put in any Crash Bandicoot game ever again. I think he makes a cameo in Twin Sanity, but that's the only game I remember, remember him from. <clears throat> so in other words, he dies off. No, he's not dead. It, they just never bothered to use him ever again. I mean, he was in Crash Team Racing, but that's a racing game. <coughs> oh. God, just jump. Just getting annoying. Why yeah, doesn't he exactly. jump over the blocks? I'm trying to. The whole objective of is, you know. There we go. Get the TNT to hit him. <laughs> First, that's the noise you always make when you don't have commentary to say. Well, no, he. I was trying to imitate his laugh. <sighs> sure you were. I was. <laughs> I know. I'm just fucking. Re rewind the video and listen. Oh wait, you won't hear my voice. But yeah. <laughs> you keep forgetting this, Chris. We're doing this now. <laughs> I forgot. This is live. I forgot. Life is a word. There we go. Three four lives. Oh, I thought it was four. Whoa, that was close. Exactly. This is one of the first out of the few temple areas that you're going to be visiting a lot. Because the second island is packed with these. The first island was mostly... Zelda, anybody? <laughs> yeah, that's kind of where I get a kind of vibe from this. Zelda, you have returned. Isn't this before Zelda? No. Oh, no, no. no. Zelda's after this. I mean, this is after Zelda. Oh, Zelda. First Zelda game came out in the 80s, dude. For the NES? No. F yeah, for the NES. Hey, that looks like Robotnik in the back. Oh, wait, never mind. It doesn't. <laughs> no. I don't know. It's. Shy guy. Some sort of, um. I don't know what it is. It's some sort of temple. I'm a bat. Temple thing? I'm not too sure. Whatever. I don't know much about Is this. Is anyone character. ever sure about anything? Uh. Bleh. Unless you, can you have be the very facts. very positive about something, but you can never be sure about it. Ooh, that was close. Exactly. <laughs> well, you can be sure about things if you have the facts, maybe. But car pack. That kind of facts. Just look up the car facts. What? Car Show me the car facts. What? What? There we go. That's what, us. what car facts, Chris? Where is there a car in here? Everywhere. There's always a car. Always. In here, it's called the uh, Borfax. 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 <laughs> Show me the Borfax. <laughs> Have your boar been Don fed? Boar has been fed? Nope. Show me the boar facts. <laughs> oh shit. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that kind of sucked. That was kind of a. It, it's a free jump. boar. Show me the boar facts. Yeah. Exactly. And then Crash Bandicoot 2 will be a polar bear, and then Crash 3 it'll be a tiger. Tigress? Tiger. Tiger. You know what tigress is from? Tigress. Sounds very familiar. Yeah. I'll nope. give you a dollar if you know who it is, where that's from. Kung Fu Panda, Marvel Studios. Okay, I owe you a dollar. So, Kung Fu Panda. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, I never watched that, Kung Fu Panda. And DC. And DC Comics. DC Comics? Yeah, they, everyone has like a tiger, tigress fucking uh, character in there. Uh, yeah. Didn't I buy a game off you for a dollar? Yeah, yeah, Brutal, Legend. Brutal Legends. Oh yeah, that was Brutal Legends. And Brutal yes, Brutal Legend. Legend makes a stunning return into our commentary with talkings. Because it's just that good of a damn game. Too bad that YouTube is such a pain in the ass that won't allow us to show any of the music. Hey, but well, we got some of it. <clears throat> we'll keep bitching about it. Well, well like... yeah, exactly. That was bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, if they're gonna give you an enemy to, you know, spin into, and they just troll you like that, that's fucking mean. Ultra troll. <laughs> I am Trollzor. Let's get out of those things now. 
Well, just I know the fact is because I I've been playing this game for a while, so I know that you can only jump on them. I don't know what makes them stop me from spinning into them. Maybe the horn on their front, but I just don't know. <clears throat> yeah. I hate those things. What these types of platforms? Yeah. Yeah, me too. That's why I calculate where I need to jump every single time. This is tricky. Not really. Know this. Here. In this game, you have to use math. Fuck. <clears throat> what does math have to do with where I need to jump? You have to calculate where you're going to jump. That's more of... God, what's what's what's, what's the term I'm looking for? History? Yeah, history, because, you know, history <laughs> is so a part of math. So then it is math. It's not, Chris. Temple. Yeah, oh, there's a numbers. temple run. It's got numbers in there. <clears throat> temple run. <clears throat> uh, we'll go back quick question. Where are you guys at in the video? I am um, 114. You just got a life. Uh, I mean, yeah. No, I'm talking, about, I'm talking about the time. 11, 20, 11, 10. 11, 11, 12, 11, 13. All right, 11, well, I'm 14. a few. Okay, well, I'm a few seconds behind because I actually hit the. Uh, left control stick on my um, Wii U pad and <laughs> I skipped that oh, ad for like 12 minutes. <clears throat> I think, I think Hoats is a, I mean, Eric, I think Eric's ahead. Well, and now I'm not. <clears throat> okay. okay, cool. Where, where are you, Chris? Uh, 1134, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, Oh, okay, cool. no, you're not. You'll never be caught up. You know why? Absolutely for everyone. Oh, uh, yeah. That's another thing I forgot to talk about. Wampa fruit. Collect 99 of them, and you get yourself an extra life. Enough said. Wampa fruit. They just look like fucking apples. That's, exactly. a, lot, that's a lot of people would be debating. They look like apples, mangoes, I maybe. Call them apples. I, I, I think it's those does. apples that, you know, that are, like, yellow, reddish. Like, the ones that are really good. Called wampa fruit? No, Chris. I think he. Are you talking about <laughs> honey crisp apples? I know. Eric. Yes. Oh, those oh ones. yeah, yeah. Those things good are good ones. Yeah, I love honey crisp apples. Yeah, those things are really good. I haven't had those. Very before. flavorful. Oh, they're, they're the most. They're the most sweet out of all the apples. There, you just got the title of the video. What? Honey crisp apples? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Honey crisp apples. <laughs> <laughs> no, but honey crisp apples. Oh. <laughs> nom 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 nom. Insert nom. insert Homer Homer drool here. Oh. Wait for it. There we go. <clears throat> no, I don't want to wait for it. The difficulty for long. this this difficulty for this game depends on how long you've been playing platformers for. If you've been playing uh, platformers for a long time that I have, you know, you should really have no trouble with this game. And especially while Eric says, you know, this er this game is so generous of giving you lives. I mean, see, look, everywhere you 34. go. 34. Yeah, everywhere you go. This game doesn't want you to lose. 35. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fact, and there you go. Want, Three more. <laughs> it wants the exact opposite. It wants to make it so damn easy that you can win, but they just want to troll you along the way. You got like, you got like five lives from when we started talking about lives. Six I know. Lives. I know, right? <laughs> Wait, Seriously. Super lives. Yeah, I know. See what I mean? And sometimes I have to admit, the isometric platforming in here, or I think it's isometric, I'm not too sure. It's more of hallway platforming. But the camera can screw you over a bit. I swear, before I hit... Great. Me, jumped but onto the... 17 boxes. Before I jumped out of the... Uh, areas to get to the goal i swear i think i was at like the tip edge of the platform that I was on before i jumped into the goal that's why i kind of jumped back a bit oh god i hate these levels no, you don't. but you have a you special it. link it. no it's not because of that it's mostly because of the platforming aspect of this level you i mean you really with how the uh, mid-air controls in here is you can really hate this level. This one isn't as bad as the next one I'll get to on the uh, third and last island, but dear God. Places, places like this make my fingers cringe, I swear. Your fingers cringe? I didn't know this was That was fingers. weird. What? It just like went through him. Well, you can't kill that warthog. 
Oh. But past me forgot about that, so I tried to do it. I'm like, oh, okay. I remember now that you cannot hurt those guys. Oh, okay. I mean, right now it's not as bad because I am... I've gotten used to the mid-air physics in this game and everything like that, but later in this one other one where we get to the uh, third island, it's going to be a pain in the ass because they expect you to make these big-ass jumps and you have to use the turtles in order for you to get across certain gaps and everything like that. I hate that so much. I mean, seriously, there's that one point where I just rapid, rapidly press the pause button in fucking anger. <laughs> Bonus level, yay! Oh, Where are the blue ones? Supper? What? Bonus level. Oh, what were you saying about the blue platforms? Well, what about, what are what's the difference with them? Uh, they're ice, dude. Oh. And you sorry, know I can't tell. I can't tell in low quality. I'm sorry. I'm colorblind. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm retarded. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> what's blue? What is this shit? That's why I asked my boss today. Jeez, what the fuck is this lives. thing? Chris, at that point, at the end of this game, I'll tell you what, I at least have uh, over 50. Okay, that's only two away. So. <laughs> well, it's just that, you know, one thing is that, you know, Crash Bandicoot is one of those games where if you save and exit the game and come back, it doesn't save your lives. You go all the way back to oh. lives again. So there's this one point before I tackle on the final levels is where I go and grind for lives. But I cut it out, though. <clears throat> this is what oh, I'm talking about right grinded, here. Grinded Using good. these damn turtles grinded in order to make hard. these wonky jumps. I mean, it's only for that part, for this one, but later, in this one level, you're going to be doing it a lot. And prepare to miscalculate your jumps and either overshoot it or undershoot it. I just love that. Every end, uh, time you finish the mission, you get the uh, Crash's head beaten on. Well, poor Crash. You suck too much. <laughs> Great, but you miss 11 boxes. We're going to chuck them at you. <laughs> whamma, 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 Wait for it. 11 throws a nitro box at him. <laughs> 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 Holy shit. <laughs> what was that? 